With the looming terror attacks, police is taking no chances as it tightens security at the matter's shrine to ensure safety of pilgrims. Several police officers have been deployed at the shrines and around the neighborhood to avert any security threats. Pilgrims have been cautioned to be vigilant and alert the police in case of any suspicious elements as police slaps a ban on website vending. I assure you of tight security around the entire shrine. Meanwhile, the Anglican Church has embarked on constructing a state-of-the-art museum at the shrines expected to cost 3 billion shillings. The groundbreaking ceremony attracted leaders from the Catholic Church who emphasized unity among Christians. <laughs> As a sign of unity, the Archbishop Stanley Intagali led mass at the Catholic Basilica while prayers at the Anglican shrines were led by the Archbishop for Kampala Diocese, Dr. Cyprian Chizitorwanga. Whereas other people are seeing that the economy of our country is growing, when you go deep in the villages, the poor are becoming poorer, whereas others are getting richer, there is a big gap. So this is the environment where most of the people of Uganda find themselves. Poverty is rampant, it is hitting so hard. Our confidence is that Jesus Christ is the light of the world. The Son and the Holy Spirit remain with you now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Several pilgrims continue to arrive at Namgongo to mark Matters Day on 3rd June. Stay at Nabakosa, WBS TV, Namgongo.